welcome everyone welcome to the channel today I am just going to be making a all-purpose seasoning mix here I have some ground ginger I have some uh, parsley I would say that's about uh, let's see I didn't really measure one two three about I would say okay five teaspoons this is um, garlic powder of one two Three, three and a half teaspoon. This is uh, onion powder. One, two, three and a half teaspoon. The thyme I'm going to be careful with because I also use um, fresh thyme in my recipes. So with this one, I'm just going to put two teaspoons. going to mix it for fish recipe and if I'm making a, a roasted chicken and I don't want it to have um, a reddish tint to tinge to it then I would uh, stop right here This is what's in this container. So this is a Nescafe's um, dry, Taster's Choice dry coffee. I love the bottle. And of course, when you can, you will, you want to be able to um, recycle or upcycle. So I love these because they're such pretty shape. And then I use this to store my spices. So what's in here is um, exactly this mixture. So I'm just going to add some more to it. okay so this is one blend now to the balance of this I am gonna add some paprika so that's one yeah about two teaspoons of paprika I also make an Indian inspired blend and that one has probably the these base seasoning and then I would add some um, seasoning that kind of unique to that to Indian recipes such so as um, dry mango powder um, cumin coriander um, uh, cardamom dry cardamom cardinome probably not even saying it right fennel that would be the uh, I'll do a video on that at some time but this is basically your standard all-purpose seasoning this will last not very long for me because I use it a lot but uh, most seasoning you know six months more than that you're gonna start losing some potency also when I go to um, dry bulk seasoning uh, where I can buy anywhere that I can buy dry um, bulk seasoning I will bring this bottle and have them weigh it and then I will fill it with um, whatever dry seasoning that I want and then um, take it home so this way I'm not using the 
plastic paper or the I'm not using the plastic to um, store I can just bring this they they weigh it I fill it and then off we go so this one would be has um, a red a red tinge to this and this one does not so if I'm making fish I like to use this one for the white meat or you know the life flavoring vegetables that you don't want it to look red like you know the cauliflowers and such zucchinis if you just want it to have as natural as a um, look as possible and then this one for beans and stuff which paprika tastes nice in and that is it to all-purpose seasoning mix thank you for watching see you in the next video